Classic Restos is proudly brought to you by Shannon's Insurance, Penright Oil, Hair and Forbes Machinery House and Pace Farm Eggs. Hello and welcome to another exciting episode of Classic Restos. But before I go any further on today's show, time for this. It's thanks to Shannon's. Ask about multi-policy discounts and sign up for the Shannon's Club. Call 134646 for a quote and see more at shannons.com.au. For oils, coolants, additives and technical assistance, oil right, use Penright. And Heron Forbes has the range. Buy online at machineryhouse.com.au. And on today's show, it's back to the gorgeous country town of Camperdown in regional Victoria. I mean, when else are the streets closed? Hundreds invade the town. Rockabilly trends go all out. And of course, there's our classic cars. It's certainly not a time to be feeling sad. And if you're down, rock on down to Camperdown for the 2015 Camperdown Cruise and Rockabilly Festival. Yes, regional Victoria does it again. There's just something about country towns in regional states of Australia. And when they become the epicentre of a four-day event such as this, it's great for the economy of the town and gives everyone something different to look forward to. The Camperdown Cruise is like a version of our own Australia's Americana. It's a bold retro attempt of replicating the American and in some respects the Australian fun way of life during the 1950s and 60s. The cruise is held along the historic tree-lined main street of Camperdown, taking in the town's iconic clock tower, historic buildings and the grand old dame, the restored Theatre Royal. So now it is time for the charm, the exuberance and sophistication of such an event. Let's go take a closer look. It's time now for Phil. It's Lucky Phil. How you going, Fletch? I'm good, mate. How are you? Good, thanks. How good is this? The 2015 Camperdown Cruise. There's a whole genre of cars here today. We've got Aussie cars, American cars, and I thought a nice way to start today's show is this original HR. Now, it's got family history. What do you got to tell us? Uh, me uncle, Dennis Power. Um, he left it to me. He died two years ago. And um, when I was 18, I had a HR. And he told me back then, he said, when I... Um, when I die, it'll be yours, and that's mine now. How does that make you feel? Perfect. Perfect. Yep. I mean, you've recreated your, your youth in one respect, too. I mean, you've yep. got another HR back. Yes. That's right. Yeah. Yep. And one with just so much significance. It's just so special. Pardon the pun, being a Holden. Now, Phil, another interesting thing. This car was bought at the Holden dealership here in Camperdown, right? Correct. Um, it was, and he paid $1,250 for it. We look up the road there now, it, it's a bakery, and that used to be the original Holden dealership. Correct, that's right. Yeah. Yep. So. Jeez, hey, from Holden's to meat pies, hey? That's just brand new. It was brand bought new. brand new. Yes, definitely brand new. Yeah. There you go. Now, we have a close look at this car too. Uh, 100% original in every respect. When you open the doors, the plastic still on the sill panels, uh, on the covers there. That's, that, that is amazing. Yep, that is amazing. Never ever been taken off. So, so. How many miles has the car done? 70,000 miles. So. But even in 70,000 miles, it's a bit over 100,000 k's, uh, yeah. to have that plastic left on uh, all that time, uh, I, he must have just, I don't, know, I don't know how he did that. Yeah, I don't know either, but they're still there. <laughs> Phil, up front we've got the trusty 186 there, uh, one of the best Holden Red Engines ever built, doing a wonderful job after all this time, still running nicely. Yes, it is, beautiful motor, and uh, it's got disc brakes on it too. Your uncle obviously didn't really sit in the car much because the original interior, again, I can't believe how good the seats are. Yep. No, they're beautiful seats, so not that he travelled far in it. <laughs> Isn't it nice to get family history on a car, something that goes way back, to yes. think that he left it to you as well? Yep, that's right. Yeah. 1967 he brought it. Yep. And um, he told me oh, back in 
1980. He said, it'll be yours. And it is. So there you go. Yeah. Good for him, mate. Good on you, Phil. Thanks again, mate. Thanks, Fletch. See you later. And uh, well done in the preservation of this HR holder. Yep. Well done. No worries. Thank you. Time for Greg now. How are you doing, Greg? Very well, thanks, Flesh. Yourself? Good, mate. Good. Before we go any further, look at the way the man's dressed. We've got the Hawaiian shirt going on there, got a bit of a biker's jacket half going on and the hat. It's uh, like a bit of a retro fit for today. Thank you. Thank you. Just trying to join in. <laughs> you certainly are doing that. And attributing to that, your 1962 Valiant. Yes, it's um, only just on the road uh, for this year for Crisis on the Murray and um, basically this is its second showing. Now before we talk about that, you had a bit of bad luck. Uh, yes, uh, paid insurances all my life, never had a claim. 15 months ago, uh, Triumph Bonneville was written off. In July, uh, we'd shifted down to Camperdown, water pipe burst in the house, it flooded. And then a month ago, bringing the car back from Maryborough had a major electrical uh, malfunction, had a fire under the dash. Oh no, it's like a worst nightmare. It is, it's uh, strike three, but uh, all insured with Shannon's and have been just so happy with the way they've uh, come to the party and you know what they've done and their, their reactions. It's been so wonderful. Good to deal with, payment through quickly. Excellent, yes, the, um, the car was at Maryborough, it was immediately trailered home, yep. then it was trailered back to Melbourne to yep. be repaired. Yep. Uh, the house is still ongoing, we hope to be back in two weeks. Yep. Uh, no, they've been fantastic. Well, they're the, at the top of their game, and as you know, give them a call, 134646 for a quote and more information. They really are a sensational company. Now, this Valiant, now, what gets me is the accessories. Now, obviously, deriving from the United States of America, they got accessories there that we didn't get here. What's the go with that second, the overrider bar up front? It's called a grill protection bar. It was an accessory that came out in 1960 in America. Very hard to find, but I was lucky to find a new old stock one, and um, it's on the car. Doesn't it make the front of the car? I mean, what a fantastic accessory. I mean, as, as bold as all get out, full of chrome, just what the, the, the United States do best, but it's not just that. What else does the car come with? Um, I've, I've tried to put a lot of the American accessories uh, just to jazz it up a bit and uh, the wife calls it the bling machine. Um, we've got the spears on the top of the front guard, the overriders, uh, it's got the full wheel cap on the boot, um, just things to jazz it up a bit. Stuff across the doors, top of the doors? Yes, there uh, was a dealer trim available uh, in Melbourne um, and then the interior I've changed all the gauges to the black. Uh, gauges like they had in, in the American cars. So. But you're a bit of a hot, a bit of a hot rodder there. The 225 slant, it's pretty close to the Hyper Pack, which was available back in the time in the United States. An all alloy block hasn't gone that far, of course. But uh, the twin carbs as well, the extractors. Yeah, I was lucky enough to find an old Speco uh, twin manifold, so I've put those on, and we're we're still ongoing. We've got a few more things to tweak, but yeah, no, it's yeah. coming up well. Good on you, Greg. Thanks for showing it off. Thank you very much, Flat. You're welcome. You're watching the sensational 2015 Camperdown Cruise and Rockabilly Festival. Back with more right after this. Every weekend around Australia. Motoring enthusiasts get together to share their passion for cars and bikes. It's a passion that brings us together. All sorts of people. All sorts of cars and bikes. From the classics of today to the classics of tomorrow. At Shannon's, we understand enthusiasts. So when it comes to insurance, it's got to be Shannon's. Shannon's, insurance for motoring enthusiasts. Call 13 46 46 for a quote. Penrite, Australian made, family owned and operated. Make premium quality engine and racing oils, warranty approved coolants, automatic transmission and manual gear oils, a complete range of engine and fuel additives, heavy duty and industrial products for every application. Visit penriteoil.com for more information. Penrite, Australian made for Australian conditions since 1926. Look what Heron Forbes has got. They've got this. They've got that. They've got this. And they've got that. They've got this. They've got that. They've got this. And they've got that. And so much more. But do you? Whatever you want, they've got. Walk through their doors, inspect their stores. Hair and Forbes has the range. And remember, you can always browse and buy online at machineryhouse.com.au. 
The man we blame, the man on a mission. We've got Arthur for 2015 here at the Camperdown Cruise and Rockabilly Festival. How are you, Arthur? Mate, awesome. If I was any happier, I'd start singing. Well, mate, you keep on getting me back, so you must be doing something right. Oh, but Fletch, look at you. You're one of the... One of my favourites, mate. <laughs> really, the coverage you do for all these shows in Australia, now the world, you're the man. Oh. Really. Well, look, Arthur, it's not, all, it's not about me here today. I mean, it's what you've created. I mean, this the little regional town here of Camperdown, yes. and, you know, streets are closed off. Yep. It doesn't happen very often. happens this time every year. It does. Yeah. Numbers, hundreds of people in the street. Oh, they estimate, look, so far we've estimated roughly around about 20,000 have sort of walked through the streets over the weekend, which is just insane. Yeah. Who would to think, you know, that this small thing, as, as your viewers out there would probably remember, it all started from a $200 barbecue. <laughs> now it's grown into an international yeah. music festival. And I think they were uh, low-quality sausages too, weren't they? <laughs> Shush! Yeah. Yeah. No, no, look, it's just been great. We've got, it's just grown so much again this yeah. year. You know, we've got Deadhead Rum from Los Angeles as our major sponsor, and they've actually come out here as well yeah. now to have it's just and see and isn't that great that they've done that because they haven't come to a cap city again they've come to a regional yeah. part of victoria exactly but we've really captured it's got a captured audience as well yeah. and the tiki marquee at the back uh, last night was just jumping yeah. now of course one big thing of the camper down cruise is obviously the classic cars oh my goodness we've got cars from all over australia we've got an amazing chop 41 merc down the back there near the clock tower sled sled like amazing Cadillacs people have just traveled from all around I can't believe it I, it's <laughs> overwhelming He's, you've overwhelmed yourself Arthur haven't well, you look at these cars here you know <laughs> they fit the fit the scene fit yeah. the town yeah. it's just beautiful it's growing each year and what I love about the camper down cruise like a lot of other car shows as well in respect of yeah. you don't know what you're going to see it's no. not just Fords it's not just Holmes I mean it's we've everything. got a whole whole you know, cross section I can see a Roadrunner over there an Impala a Bel Air a Cadillac right here in front of me now yeah. yes. beautiful yeah. now when you come along to the 2016 camper down cruise what can they expect to see here well, the international acts I've got next year are just going to be mind-blowing. We've got Charlie Thompson from the Netherlands. We've got the Barn Stompers from Germany. It's just going to be insane. We've got Jay Milano from Austin, Texas. Now, these artists are just amazing. Good on you, mate. And again, we keep on getting back to this country town thing. Such a small town, a beautiful one at that hosting such a major yeah, event so you know right. hats off to you there mate well it's the Kerengamite Shire they're just so behind this event which it could not be possible by having the Shire behind you you know the local police amazing they love the event like we have a policeman's choice award it's they just get behind it they love it so how could you how could you not you know hold it in such a beautiful historic town okay well, now You've got to have a website. What's the details on that? The website is www.camperdowncruise.com.au. There you go. And Web we have the Facebook pages as well. Awesome. There you go. Website details and Facebook down the bottom of the screen right now. Check it out for 2016 for more information and catch up with this beaut bloke. Good on you, buddy. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for everybody to coming as well. I really appreciate it. Thanks, Arthur. It means a lot. Thank you, Fletch. So everything's here at the Camperdown Cruise, and this is proof. This bloke, he does exist. Moving through, time for Charlie now on today's show. Hello, Charlie. How Hello, are you? Fletch, how are you, mate? Nice to see you. Mate, good to see you too. Gorgeous 1956 Fairlane. What's the deal? Uh, I, I was looking around for a, a baby bird for my wife, and we ended up with this. <laughs> something a bit bigger? Yeah, something a bit bigger, yeah. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> Yeah, it's a how, beautiful car. How cool are you? Is it a good car to drive? Very good. Like brand new, mate. Like brand new. Yeah. Can't believe it. It's a lot to be said for something so old. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So it's, it's a pleasure to drive it, you know. Very nice to drive. Very quiet. Yeah. So is this the, um, is this the first type of uh, car like this that you've actually had? No, I've got another 55 Ford Fairlane. Yep. A two-door, though. Yep. This is a four-door. Yep. The difference, yeah. Well, you got best of both worlds. Yeah, we have. Yeah, yeah. 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 Very nice, yeah. That's so good. So uh, condition-wise, Charlie, when you got a hold of this, uh, how was it? Exactly how you see it, mate. I was lucky enough to buy it like that, turnkey and go, mate. Yeah, yeah. Only way to buy them. It can save a few problems, can't it? A lot, a lot of headaches yeah. and a lot of problems. When you're a young bloke, how far does it go back with your passion for American cars? Uh, my father used to have them, and that's why I love these cars, yeah. you know. That's 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 going back, you know. You would have been a cool kid back in those days with a dad were, that was driving American cars yeah, back then. Yeah, yeah, he had a, uh, he had the Australian one though, the yeah, Australian right. custom line, you yeah, know. Yeah. yeah. 
yeah. we call them custom lines, they call them fair lanes. Yeah, well, uh, yeah. all same cars, you That's know, right. based on USA themes, same panels and designs, they all rode the same and went the same, didn't they? Yeah, that's right, all the same, it's just different, yeah. you know, different yeah. chrome and that on them. It's just the way that they finished the cars back yeah. in those days, you know, like the the extra bright work and just the shape of the panels, yeah. the, the enormity, uh, their size, I mean, everything was just so, well... Exaggerated. Yeah, unbelievable. The the chrome work just when you look at a car with chrome, it's unbelievable, mate. Yeah, you know, yeah. just makes makes them. You know. Absolutely. Now, what powers it up front, Charlie? Uh, it's got a two nine two um, uh, original motor. It's a matching number car. Yeah. yeah, it's all original. What a fun, what a famous old engine by Ford, eh? The old two nine two. The uh, Y block. Mm. Yep. Yeah, 292 wide block. They put them in baby birds, I put them in trucks. Yeah, that's right, in trucks, <laughs> 292, yeah, that's right, everything, yeah. yeah. Good on you, Charlie, good to see you, mate. No uh, no. Supporting a very nice fair lane here, 1956, and good to see the hat going on as well, too. Yeah, mate, you've got to yeah. have the hat. Yeah. It's uh, the dressing in theme, and I just right. kind of think that's extra nice. Yeah, and it's a good weekend up there, isn't it? It's absolutely. absolutely grouse. Yeah. Doesn't Arthur do a good job? Yeah, he does a very good job, mate, yeah, yeah. very nice, yeah. I tell you what, he, he, he takes a lot on, but wow, look at the event that he pulls together every yeah, year. Very good, yeah. It's getting bigger and bigger every year, actually. Oh, work. Yeah. yeah. All right, take care, Charlie. No good worries, on you, buddy. Please. Thanks, mate. Thanks for everything. All right, mate? No worries. If you love your classic Americana iron, you're going to love a Fletch tour in 2016. Have a look at this. There is nothing quite like a Fletch Tour. Carlisle or Ford Nationals, GM Nationals and Chrysler Nationals await you. Coming on the Fletch Tour was, was really great. The people that run the tour are fantastic. Experience Route 66 from Chicago to Vegas or choose the Detroit Tour, attending the Woodward Dream Cruise. If you're going to travel anywhere, you've got to do a Fletch Tour. On a Fletch Tour, you looked after every step of the way. See FletchTours.com or contact All Things Travel, Lara. Look what Hair and Forbes has got. They've got this. They've got that. They've got this. And they've got that. They've got this. They've got that. They've got this. And they've got that. And so much more. But do you? Whatever you want, they've got. Walk through their doors, inspect their stores. Hair and Forbes has the range. And remember, you can always browse and buy online at machineryhouse.com.au. In 1926, Australia's Penrite Oil Company was established. Almost 90 years of research, development and refining under the harsh Australian conditions has made Penrite Oil what it is today. Precision. Performance. Reliability and protection. Championship winning products. Trust Penrides. We've always had a few cars. They're all special. The T-Bird. Oh, that's mine. The Combi for when we want to get away. The XR8. It's going to be a classic. They're all insured with Shannon's. We've also got Shannon's home and contents cover. Which helps protect our automotive collectibles, tools and memorabilia in the home and garage. If you're motoring enthusiasts like us, it's got to be. Shannon's. Shannon's. Insurance for motoring enthusiasts. Call 13 46 46 for a quote. Back in 1929, they didn't make cars quite as fast as this. Nice hot rod with a caravan on back. We'll talk about that in a moment. In the meantime, we've got John. How are you, John? Good, thanks, Fletch. Yeah, no, we're all good, mate. Enjoying that, the weather. That's wonderful. Now, you would be one of... Uh, there wouldn't be too many guys like John here this weekend. Tell us where you have driven from, where you're going to. You're on some kind of mission, aren't you? Yes, we've driven down from Darwin. We left Darwin the end of August. Uh, went to the Red Centre Nats in Alice Springs, and then we came on down here. And we're just gonna do all the different rod runs uh, in Victoria. We, every weekend we've got a different rod run to go to. And just where we get, we end up in Bustleton at the end of uh, March next year, and then head back up the West Coast, back to Darwin. So you basically travel right around Australia. Isn't that, you're living the dream, aren't you? Oh, absolutely, love it. You're going to Queenscliff next year? We're going to Queensland, we're already yep. booked, yeah, yep. we're entering number 21, so there we're all go. ready to go. Uh, that's yeah. a great event for the Hot Rodders oh, yeah. in 2016, Queenscliff event. Now, John, we're going to talk about the caravan on the back there in a moment. Uh, now, this rod, 1929, 
What do you got up front that's powering it? We're running a 351 Cleveland and a C10 gearbox and an 8 and 3 quarter inch diff. Now, in a serious department, and just quickly, I'd like to touch upon the beautiful graphic that you've got on the trunk lid of your daughter, Tina. Yeah. Uh, I'd like you to share with us the story there with Tina. Uh, yeah, we lost our daughter and three grandkids in the fires at King Lake in 2009. And yeah, so she was a real big hot rodder. She was building a 34 Ford and of course that all got destroyed in the fires. So when that happened, we ended up buying the Model A Roadster and we decided to go to all the rod runs and, and more of what she used to go to, just to keep her dreams alive. And that's what we're doing now. So every rod run we try and go to, to is, is the ones that she went to, plus whatever else we went to. We took the car to New Zealand to because she was born in New Zealand and she loved the hot rodders over there so we took the car and the camper back to New Zealand two years ago and did the beach hop and memory of her as well. Went to the nostalgia drags over there and we really enjoyed it. It was great. Had a great ball. It's quite a coping mechanism being in a position to be able to drive around Australia. I mean I just take my hats off to you guys. Uh, it's nice to see now that I hope you're having a ton of fun along the way. Oh I absolutely love every little minute of it. Hey? We've, like we've been well, in the six years, we've done just about all of Australia. The only part we really haven't done at this point is up the West Coast, which is on the cards after Bustleton next year. And we'll go up the West Coast. We've been right around Australia. We've been to Perth a couple of times. Uh, like I said, we've been New Zealand. We've been to Tassie, got snowed on. <laughs> but yeah, we love it. We love it. We wouldn't wouldn't change it for anything. Oh, you're a remarkable yeah. fellow, John. You really are. Now, on that note, tell us about your caravan out back, because I reckon that's pretty cool. Yep. And uh, you're saving a fortune in your um, motel bills, too. Yeah, absolutely. What we try and do, we've got it all solar powered, so everything's on power. We've got TV, we've got fridges and everything, all solar powered. So we do a lot of free camping. And that saves a lot of money, and you can then that money will go into the fuel. So that's the way you can get for it. the for the big Clevo. <laughs> absolutely, got to live in the back of the vans that run the Clevo. That's yeah, that's yeah, a fair yeah. enough. That's fair enough yeah. trade off, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Now you're travelling around Australia. You've got your wife Jean there. There's a shot of you and Jean next to the caravan. Yeah. Uh, you guys, you you're really having a ball, aren't you? Oh yeah, absolutely. And she enjoys it, which is the main thing, because it's only a small van. You only got a room just to turn around it, and that's yeah, you, it. You made it small deliberately, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Make you comfortable. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. I think it's pretty safe to say on behalf of myself and the entire uh, you at home watching and big broad audience of Classic Restos, no matter where you're watching this from, we love you guys and uh, what you stand for and uh, mate, keep up the fantastic work and we just hope that continue, well you continue having a wonderful trip around Australia. We will Fletch, we'll absolutely do that and we like your program as well, great program, yeah very good. Alright, take care John. Thanks very much, I'll catch you later Fletch. Right. Fletchy moving on through here, down on his knees, how are you Kerry? I'm good thanks Fletch, how are you? Good, 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 1967 Coupe de Ville convertible, wow what a monster this is. That's gorgeous, I love it. And you're dressed in theme too. I mean, you, you uh, yeah, got to get got to get in the theme. This uh, this event here at Camp is one of the events where there are so many people that do dress in theme and get a part of it. Now, this particular convertible, uh, what's the rundown on it, Kerry? What can you tell us about this car? Oh, not a lot. Love the colour. Mm -hmm. um, it's my husband's. <laughs> he bought it a couple of years ago over in Adelaide. Bought it back. He's done a little bit of work. Not not too much to it. Cleaned it up a little bit. Okay, so uh, in the time you've had it, have you had to do anything to it? Uh, he hasn't done a lot to it, just cleaned it up, tidied it up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, the burgundy red is gorgeous. I mean, it's really, it's really, it's a real rich colour, isn't it? Yes, it's sensational. It was not painted not long before we actually purchased it. That was a bonus. Yeah, because you must be rich people too, because it's really nice paint. If you were poor people, it would be all faded and everything. That's it. That's yeah. it. No, I wish. <laughs> Kerry, through the eyes of a lady, the aesthetics of the Cadillac, what, what is it that you love about the car? Ah, uh, just the sleek line, you know, it's it's low, I like it without the top on obviously, um, I just don't think they're the same sort of car, it's just the whole feel of the cruise and the, it's fun, you know, uh, we frock up, um, the girls all jump in the back of this car, um, sometimes the guys all jump across the front seat, you know, it feels like a party car, yeah, yeah. yeah you can enjoy it, you can share it. But, but what about the ride though? Oh, it's awesome, it's comfier than my lounge suite. At home. I mean, these are literally the, they're, they're literally the cars that you really don't feel bumps in. Oh, no, no. We've got a couple others in the shed and they're a bit of a tough, hard ride. <laughs> yeah, we've, yeah, we've come about three and a half, four yeah. hours yeah. down to the show and it was very cruisy yeah. sitting in there. So very comfy. Good on you, Kerry. Thanks for being part of Classic Restos today at the 2015...
Camperdown Cruise and Rockabilly Festival. Well done. Thank you, Fletch. You're most welcome. Well, there you have it. Just some of the 2015 Camperdown Cruise and Rockabilly Festival. They close off the streets. What a hoot of an event. Try and make it here in 2016. And in the meantime, classicrestos.com.au is the website that you need for the DVD boxed sets of the show. Classic Restos merchandise, contact information on joining us on a Fletch tour in 2016, including travelling Route 66. There's contact information there for major sponsors as well. As I say at the end of every show, no matter where you're watching from, until next week, please ride and drive safe. I'm Fletch, and I thank you very much for watching. You can like and follow us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash classic restos TV and watch catch up episodes at shannons.com.au. Classic Restos is proudly brought to you by Shannon's Insurance, Penrite Oil, Hair and Forbes Machinery House, and Pace Farm Eggs.